Hi everyone. In this video we will show you how to add, to read, to delete data in document related to Firebase Real Time Database via Delphi FMX app. Today remote databases are widely used to store different kind of data, such as information about users and products in online store, patients data in clinic, etc. For this purpose, both traditional relational and document related databases can be used. Document related databases are more flexible. You can use API to access them. So we can just use get, put, post, delete, request to get, to write, and to delete data. To work with Firebase Realtime database, we will use Firebase API. So let's go to console and open our previously created Firebase project. How to create Firebase project we described in previous video. In our project let's select real-time database type. Then just click create database. The next step is choosing our database location. Let's leave United States and click next. So here we need to choose start in no locket mode or start in test mode. In test mode our database will be available for 30 days. To provide better security let's choose locked mode. Click enable. Firebase Real-Time Database successfully created. We will use URL to access database in our Delphi FMX app. To access our database in locked mode, we must use secret key. We can find it here. Go to Service Accounts. Go to database secrets. Here is our secret key. Just copy and save secret key for further using in our Delphi FMX app. As an example, in our Delphi FMX app, we will save information about people, names and name profession to Firebase Real-Time Database. Then we will get this information from our Firebase Real-Time Database. Also, we will delete records in our database. To simplify our work with Firebase Real-Time Database, API, we developed special class to Firebase Helper. Class constructor takes object net HTTP client to net HTTP client class. Sin constants database URL and secret key as input parameters. Database URL contains our database URL. Secret key contains our secret key to access to our database in secure mode. Format JSON function shows JSON response from Firebase Real-Time Database in readable form. Put method takes object data to JSON object class as input parameter. Object data includes all data, in our example name, surname, profession, to write to our database. All data in object presented in key value format. Second parameter is string constant path. It contains database path and record name. Multipart from data object takes all data such as name, surname, profession from object data in JSON format for further saving them to database via put request by using Fnet HTTP client.
If not client object takes f database URL field which contains database's URL as input parameter. The second input parameter is in constant path. FNet HTTP client also takes multi platform data as input parameter. JSON response from Firebase API will write to response content object, the same stream class. By using the Firebase helper class, we can work with Firebase real-time database in secure mode. So also, we we'll transfer secret key. Put method returns JSON response, we will transfer data to database. Here example of all transferred data to database. Get method takes constant pass as input parameter. Pass contains database path and record name to get from database. By get request via fnet http client we will get data from database. This example of data. Get method returns a JSON response from Firebase real time database API. This response contains data from database. Delete method also takes constant path as input parameter. It contains database path and record name to delete from database. We will delete data from database via delete request. To work with Firebase around time database by using put get delete request to manipulate data in our database, we use the net HTTP client component in our Delphi FMX app. In our Delphi FMX app, we will transfer three parameters to database. They are name, surname and profession. To input these parameters, we will use the edit component. By using our app, we can write data to database. Also, we can get all data from database or get record by surname. Our app also has delete record by surname feature. All these features implemented in button on click handles, the button class. JSON response with data from database we will show by using the memo component. We will declare two fields, fsecret key and fdatabase URL. They contain database URL and secret key. In form on create method, we will transfer previously saved URL and secret key. Let's consider put to db button and click handle to write our data to database. 
For this purpose, we declare Firebase object. I Firebase helper type. To store data with the transferring to database, we will use the JSON to DB object. To store JSON response from Firebase real time database, we will stream variable answers from Firebase. Then we call the Firebase helper class constructor and transfer our net HTTP client 1 component and f Firebase URL and f secret key field values. Set parameters as name, surname, profession. We can add to JSON to DB object for further writing to database by using that pair in a form of key value. Here are keys name, surname, and profession. We can read the values from the edit fields edit name. Edit surname and edit profession. Text property. We can add unlimited parameters quantity by using add pair. In our app, we have three parameters. Then we will do put request to write our data to database. For this purpose, we will use Firebase object put method. Put method takes JSON to DB with our data to write to database and pass with record name in our case to name. To avoid our app user interface blocking while performing requests to database, we will use the task. To store JSON response from database, we will use variable answer from Firebase. To show JSON response from Firebase real time database, we will use the thread synchronize method to update the memo in main thread. So, let's run our Delph FMX app and test writing data to Firebase real time database feature via put method. Let's consider the button get all from db and click handler. This handler implements read all data from Firebase real time database. For this purpose, we will use class the Firebase helper get method. Get method takes database path as input parameter. JSON response from database will display via the memo. Our Delph FMX app has also get from database by surname feature. We will use the same get method with pass to db and uh, corresponding record name. We can easily delete records in our database by surname. 
For this purpose, we will use class to Firebase helper delete method. It takes path to DB and the name of person, which record we want to delete. In the memo, we will show a result of the operation. Let's run our app to read from database and to delete some records. Get all information from DB. Get by surname. and try to delete some records. 